everybody, this is our first video update, and uh, we want to start it off with a really big thank you from Camouflage and from Logan for all of your support, all of your really good questions, and all of your pledges. Um, I think we're close to 2,000 pledges and about $75,000, which is really awesome. And we know we've got a long ways to go, but we've got a number of really cool, exciting announcements that we're, pre we're prepping right now. And, uh, and we're just trying to spend all of our time getting the word out and also kind of answering any questions that comes in. And so that's going to be the format for this really quick video, is allowing you guys to ask questions directly to the team at Camouflage. So uh, let's get right to it. What have been some of the challenges in developing Republic thus far? Well, I think one of the biggest challenges, at least for me, is to create a, ba a good balance between the gameplay and the fact that Hope is her own character. Because you need to get the input from the player and transform that as a partnership between the player and Hope. And you have to help, gu you have to guide her to, to help her escape the facility. On the Kickstarter video, we heard about this thing called Beast Mode. What is that? Beast Mode is when, or is where everybody on the team is basically in crunch mode. Uh, I've seen many nights where we've gone home maybe at 5, 6 a.m. and been back here three or four hours later. And not bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, groggy, but ready to work and get, get it done. If we pledge to Kickstarter, how do you plan on delivering the game? We worked it out with Apple before we launched the campaign to make sure that we could deliver the game to anybody who pledges more than $10 to the campaign. So they outlined a number of different ways that we could do it, different methods, and we're going to choose that as we get closer to launch. But the good news is we can guarantee that you're going to get the game. Can we see more visuals of the rewards on your Kickstarter page? The answer, short answer, yes. We're going to be able to see that real soon. It's, uh, I spoke to Logan today, and we're going to be revealing some really cool things like the iPhone case, the t-shirt design, the hoodie, and even the poster. And I think the fans are going to be very happy with it. So based on your past games that you've worked on, what kind of influences from those games do you think have uh, kind of found its way into the design of Republic? I'd say cover, a lot of, a lot of cover-based mechanics. Brothers in Arms was pretty, a lot of cover, cover-based stuff, and then Fear was even more so cover-based. It's very similar to setting up the stealth in here for Hope, um, and just having good pacing for options to, for the player to send places for her to go to, and also for uh, her own AI to make choices based on what's around her. Why not just announce a PC version of Republic? Yeah, I think it's a, it's a really cool uh, problem to have when people are really excited about your game and they want it on all the different platforms that they really, really are into. Um, and the team is, themselves are really into PC and, and Mac as well. Um, and, but we have to come back to like, why we decided to design this game in the first place. Why, do we, why, why we wrote this story specifically for um, iOS devices. So uh, really the focus of the team is on that right now. And if in the future, you know, down the road, if we have a few months to redesign the game, we're going to redesign the game um, for PC and Mac specifically and re actually redo the story specifically for the whole idea that you're going to be you know, at your desk interacting with Hope this way and that you're going to have a mouse and keyboard. So really the focus is on iOS right now, but down the road, we definitely do want to do like a PC and Mac version. Can I get a new iPad from Camouflage so I can really enjoy the Republic experience? Um, you know... Uh, <laughs> I don't think I'm at liberty to answer that, but short answer, um, maybe. Um, please ditch iOS and put Republic on PlayStation Vita. Uh, are you serious? Like, really? What? I mean, I don't know. I can't answer that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Cut. <laughs>